Following the disappearance of Carol Baskin's then-husband Don Lewis, people developed many theories as to what exactly happened to the millionaire. However, former New York City prosecutor Alex Spiro, now hired by Don Lewis's family, suggests the investigation should focus on the hours surrounding Lewis's disappearance. Well, there are all sorts of um, theories about what might have happened to Don. One of them was that he was tossed out of an airplane. Do you find that credible? Sometimes in high profile cases, people come up with fanciful theories of, you know, tigers, lions, bears, and airplanes. I mean, there's usually a simpler explanation of things. Carol Baskin, in diary entries shared with the Tampa Bay Times, says the last time she saw Don Lewis was the early morning of August 18, 1997, after she had returned home from running a late night errand. At 11 o'clock, you know, she had these kittens that were in the house. There was a bobcat kitten and two caracal kittens. And um, she didn't have enough ingredients for the milk. In Carol Baskin's diary entries, she says that she left Don at their home and went out to a supermarket about six miles away, only to find out that the store was closed. Baskin then explains that her car broke down, forcing her to walk all the way home. She says she didn't get home until 4 a.m. And then when she got home, Don wanted to immediately go back and get the car. So at four in the morning, they went back he got the radiator cap off, put water in it, and then they drove home. Baskin says that two hours later, Lewis got up and left the house. That was the last time she saw him. It's very hard in the 21st century to go missing-missing as a middle-aged man who has a very active cellular records, banking records, etc. Carol Baskin maintains she had nothing to do with Don's disappearance. I didn't kill Don. 